We are starting with the thermal collector this morning, which is great. And we're digging out the, the connection to the house right now. And uh, we're gonna be working our way up the garden and getting that in. So, well, it should take us a couple of days, I guess. It's quite long, we're heading up about 50 meters up the garden and then back again in two, two, two legs, if you will. And the pipes that we have, you'll see anyway, but they're in coils and they're laid in then in the coils, in the ground, all the trenches that we're digging. Yeah, oh, that's really good. It just means we can be able, we'll be able to close up all the holes and the gaps and mounds of earth that we've had around the house and make it all a bit nicer. I have a white hat from Heidi. Thank you, Heidi, in Idaho. We are going to try and keep this hat white. Not gonna happen.
So the digger's doing his thing outside right now, sieving the earth and putting a fine layer on the uh, pipes. And we're removing the oven. The chimney is now gone. And I've got a hole to repair. So I'm gonna crack on with that. those two strips again with the fine cement. So the rings have been covered with a fine earth. And now they'll be covered with the rest of the earth. And then we continue the loop around where the digger is now and back down on this side where there's a whole load of earth to be moved again. So we're now on the other side for the thermal collector, the digger is working and there's more to do.
So, after a couple of long days of digging, the loop is almost uh, in. Well, it's pretty been, it's been pretty good. My hat is still fairly white, a bit dusty. Uh, but now you can see we're connecting almost to the second loop, which is just behind the digger. The rest is getting filled in step by step because we've got so much material that uh, yeah, the, the digger driver is having a bit of a hard time with it. We're at some points it's like we're digging three meters down, so because we're on a slope. And we've got to try and work out the levels for the garden as well while digging this. So that's what we're doing there. We're also putting in a water and electricity uh, line for the garden shed that's coming in halfway up the garden, a new one. And uh, yeah, so the loops are going like out here. You can see the out ones. It's where the cold goes in. And as it goes round the system, it should get warmer so that when it comes back, we have a warm water coming into the house to push up the heat. So we made it through. 